Welcome back, Rise Up 44 here on Nalio Gaming playing Mountain Blade Warband on the PlayStation 4. Mountain Blade Warband is by Tail Worlds and Raven's Court. Jumping right in. Start a new game. Alright. You approach a field where the locals are training with weapons. You can practice here to improve your combat skills. Oh, wow. Okay. Rider, rider. Alright. R2 is swing. Okay, R1 changes weapon. L2 seems to be like a dodge stance. Squares kick. X is jump. Um, okay, that's cool. L3 actually changes your view from first person to third. And R3 zooms you in. That's pretty neat. Alright, let's go, uh, let's go do some training. I want to practice attacking. I want to practice blocking with my weapon. Let's do some practice let's begin that I'm ready actually I wanted to do something else let's novice fighter <laughs> that was awesome no that was enough for me that was awesome what's the next guy I want to practice attacking. <laughs> this is great. No, that's enough for me. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Uh, let's go shoot some bow and arrow, archery, whatever you call it. What's up, dude? Riding. Okay, let's ride first. Approach the horse, triangle to mount. I right, towards the next waypoint. How do you go faster? Oh, he just automatically goes faster, or what? Oh, okay, if you um, just press forward on the left thumbstick, it makes you go uh, faster and then pull back and makes you slow down. That's pretty neat. That's pretty cool. Decent control. How do I get off? All right, I'm ready. I hope you enjoyed the ride. Now we move on to something a bit more difficult. Grab the lance you see over there and ride around the course, hitting each target at least once. Now I'm all set with that. You know what? Let's rock and roll. I'm ready to play.
I understand the basic mechanics, so here we go. Welcome, adventurer, to Mountain Blade Warband. Before beginning the game, you must create your character. Remember that in the traditional medieval society depicted in the game, war and politics are usually dominated by male members of the nobility. That does not, however, mean that you should not choose to play a female character or one who is not of noble birth. Male nobles may have a somewhat easier start, but women and commoners can attain all of the same goals and, in fact, may have a much more interesting, if more challenging, early game. Hmm. Uh, let's see. You were born years ago in a land far away. Your father was an impoverished noble, a traveling merchant, a veteran warrior, a hunter, a nomad, a thief, warrior as a child your father scrabbled out a meager living from your father's wages as a guardsman to the local lord it was not an easy existence and you were too poor to get much of an education you learned mainly how to defend yourself on the streets with or without a weapon in hand you started to learn about the world almost as soon as you could walk and talk you spent your early life as hmm you know what? I don't like that. <laughs> I just don't like it. You came into the world as a son of a declining nobility owning only the house in which they lived. However, despite your family's hardships, they afforded you a good education and trained you from childhood for the rigors of aristocracy and life at court. I don't like that either. Traveling merchant. You were born the son of a traveling merchant, always moving from place to place in search of a profit. Although your parents were wealthier than most and educated you as well as they could, you found little opportunity to make friends on the road, living mostly from the moments when you could sell something to somebody. Nope, don't like that either. I don't know. I guess... Let's try a hunter. You were the son of a family who lived off the woods, doing whatever they needed to make ends meet, hunting, woodcutting, making arrows, even a spot of poaching whenever things got tight. Winter was never a good time for your family as the cold took animals and people alike, but you always lived to see another dawn. Though your brothers and sisters might not be so fortunate, you started to learn about the world as soon as you could walk and talk. You spent your... I like that one. All right. A craftsman, apprentice, a shop assistant, or, um, there, that'll work. A bull, as a boy growing out of childhood, you are apprenticed with the local craftsman to learn a trade. After years of hard work and study under your new master, he promoted you to journeyman and employed you as a fully paid craftsman for as long as you wished to stay. Then as a young adult, life changed as it always does. You became a squire, a troubadour, I don't know what that is university student a goods peddler a smith a game poacher it's a squire though though the distinction felt sudden to you somewhere along the way you had become a man and the whole world seemed to change around you when you were named squire to a noble at court you practiced long hours with weapons learning how to deal out hard knocks and how to take them too you were introduced in your obligations to your lord and of your duties to those who might one day be your vassals but in addition to learning the chivalric ideal you also learned about the less uplifting side old warrior warrior stories of ruthless power politics of the betrayals and i don't like that going back Trub a troubadour what's 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 a troubadour though the distinction felt sudden to you somewhat along the way you had become a man your own voice, except the instrument slung over your back and... Nope. Something to do with playing music, that's not me. University student. You found yourself as a student in the university of one of the great cities, where you studied theology, philosophy, and medicine, but not all lessons were learned in the lecture. You may or may not have joined in with your fellows at as they roamed the alleys in search of wine, women, and a good fight however you certainly were able to observe how it how a broken jaw is set or how an angry townsman can be persuaded to set down his club and accept cash 
compensation for the destruction of his shop. Nope. The goods peddler a smith. What's a smith? You pursued a career as a smith, crafting items of function and beauty out of simple metal. As time wore on, you became a master of your trade and fine work started to fetch fine prices with food in your belly and logs on your fire you could take pride in your work and growing reputation but soon everything changed and you decided to strike out on your own as an adventure yep there it is that's mine personal revenge the loss of a loved one wonderless being forced out of your home lust for money and power personal revenge loss of a loved one wonderlust only you know exactly what caused you to give up your old life and become an adventurer. All you can say is that you couldn't bear to stay. Not with the memories of those love you loved. Yeah, I like that. Become an adventurer and ride. There we go. Now enter your name. Rise. Cool. Alright, so now we gotta... Plus attributes, agility, strength, 10, intuition, 7, charisma, agility, there we go, one handed weapon, two handed weapons, pole arms, archery, crossbows, throwing, two handed weapons, way up. Archery is way up. Pole arms, eh. Crossbow, eh. Throwing. Alright, that works. Now we got the middle. Iron flesh, power strike. Power throw. Power draw. Weapon master. Shield. Athletics, riding, horse archery, looting, wound treatment. Oh boy, I gotta take some of those back. Adjust your character. Oh well, let's go. I don't even care. Let's go. Randomize. Randomize, 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 randomize. That'll work. <clears throat> no, it won't. What the heck's up with the back of his head? Jeez. That'll work.
That works. character. I'll, I'll work with that. You hear about Caloradia, a land torn between rival kingdoms, battling each other for supremacy, a haven for knights and mercenaries, cutthroats and adventurers, all willing to risk their lives in pursuit of fortune, power, or glory. In this land which holds great dangers and even greater opportunities, you believe you may leave your path past behind and start a new life. You feel that finally you hold the key of your destiny in your hands free to choose as you will in that whatever course you take great adventures will await you drawn by the stories you hear about Cal 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 Radia and its kingdoms you join a caravan to Pravan in the kingdom of Swadia join a caravan to one two three four five six seven eight let's go with this one you're exhausted. All right. Here we go. Oh, man, I already got a guy coming at me. What the? Dude, I just arrived here and I already got dudes attacking me. What's up with that? Oh, he's, he's not a bad guy. Okay, Merchant of Rav Ravadin. Are you alright? Well, I guess you're alive at any rate. I'm not sure that we can stay the same for another... Say the same for another... For that other fellow. That's one last thief to trouble our streets at night. Although, heaven knows, he won't be the last. Anyway, maybe you can help me with something. Let's talk more inside out here. We don't know who's listening. The merchant takes you to his house. Once society stands at the door for a while, checking the street. Okay. Merchant Raymond Dan. Cool. I mean, let's see. Merchant of Raymond. Now let me explain my position. Proposition. We've always had brigands in the hills. Leaving their camps because of all the fighting on the frontiers. The most logical explanation is that these bandits have an ally inside the walls who helped them to enter unnoticed. Last week, you see, I don't know what my brother was thinking, but he's family, so what can you do? No doubt the gang will soon send word about a ransom, but I don't care to pay it. I'm interested, I'm not interested to have more important business. I'm interested. You won't be able to do this by yourself, though. If you try and take on the whole gang single-handedly, the hunter will become the hunted. I'll warrant. You'll first want to round up a group of volunteers. There's always a few lads in the villages around here looking for a bit of work. That's more interesting than tilling the soil or hauling water. Okay. Very good, sir. I'll go collect some men from around the village. Good. You can find me again in the tavern here in... Ray Vanden, after you've got your group together, then we'll speak about what to do next. Alright. You have taken your first quest. You may view your quest log by pressing touchpad at any time in the game. Okay. You are now viewing the overland map. Oh, jeez. This place is huge! Holy... Dude, this game is ridiculously big. This game is legit. I mean, I've heard about it 
but I didn't know it was this big. Jeez. This is impressive. All right, so where am I? I'm right here. The town of Ray Vanden seems to be flourishing. The people look well fed and relatively content. Craftsmen do a thriving business and some migrants appear to be coming here from other regions to seek their luck. You see the banner of the king of the kingdom um, of Vagris over the town gates. The populace is diff indifferent to you. Take a walk around the streets, go to the castle, visit the tavern, enter the arena, go to the marketplace. Take a walk around the streets. This game's pretty cool. You know, it's like, uh... I mean, it's not, you know, same type, but it's like Skyrim. You know, that sort of gameplay. So where do I find these people to fight with me? I'm looking for some equipment. Show me what you have. Goodbye. I don't have money yet. I got a little bit from that guy, but I gotta find some people. What can you tell me about what's in your trade? What is the latest rumor around here? I heard that there will be a tournament in very soon okay how is life here times are hard sir but we must count our blessings what is your trade I work in Smith in a smithy, sir, making all sorts of ironwork. Knives, axes, pots, plow blades, siths, hammers, anvil tongues, saws, nails, horseshoe, coarse arms, and armor for your excellences. What is the latest? I heard that there will be a tournament in Oxil soon. Okay, so there's all sorts of tournaments I'm, uh, sh I'm sure you can go take part in. Very cool. Mind your manners within the walls and we'll have no trouble. Hello, stranger. You seem to be new. I am the guild master of the town. Can you tell me ab about what you do? Do you happen to have a job for me? I have some questions of the political nature. How is the trade around here? How does the wealth of the region compare with the rest of the... I wish to buy land in this town. Do you happen to know have a job for me? Can you tell me about what you do? I am the guild master. You can say I am the leader of the good people of... Who rules the town? Our town's lord and protector is king... Yar Oglick. Okay, that's all I need to know. Thanks. Go to the castle. I'll take a walk to the arena. Go to the castle. We are not supposed to talk while on guard, sir. Do I know you? My name is Rise. At your service. I am Lethwin Far, Seeker, son of Hakrim the Old, who should be king of the Nords of Calradia. I thought Kingdom of Nords was ruled by King Ragnar. I am called the Far Seeker because I have traveled great distances, even by the stands of the Nords, in search of knowledge. Alright. My father died, however. I want to take your cause and help you reclaim your throne. Sure. Wow, okay. That's pretty cool. Do I know you?
<laughs> I'm telling this dude I'll take I'll take him up on that's funny you may be common birth but know that I am always looking for good men to fight for me you know do you have any tasks for me my lord I have come to offer you my sword and I wish to ask you something that I will hunt him down and execute the law okay I got another mission food all out ready to be eaten by these wealthy people here while all the others are starving down below go to the town center okay So, looks like I got a lot to do, and I'm definitely going to have my hands full. So one gameplay at a time, that's my intro here, very very interesting. So, judging by the bottom here, it seems I can camp. You set up camp. What do you want to do? Take an action. Wait here for some time. Resume traveling. Wait here for some time. Oh, look at that. Someone just took off. That's pretty cool. So... And... Yeah, so I'm watching people take off from here. That's pretty neat. Um, there's different reports. Party. It seems you can team up with people or, you know, join up. I don't know if it's a faction system or what, but... Recruit some of your prisoners to your party. Select a book to read. Retire from adventuring. Back to camp menu. Wait here. Resume traveling. So it seems I got my hands full. This game is pretty huge. There's a lot to do. And when I go ahead and continue on, I will record it here on Alio Gaming for you all to see. I appreciate you watching. This is my first gameplay with Mountain Blade Warband on the PlayStation 4. Click that like button if you haven't already done so. Let me know in the comment section what you think of Mountain War Mountain Blade. Let me know what you think of Mountain Blade Warband. And subscribe to me here on Nalio Gaming. Until next time, thanks for watching. So it's pretty clear that I got my hands full. This game is huge. That's not a bad thing. Um, there's a lot to it, and I'm pretty intrigued and interested. This is a game you could probably get lost in for a long time, so... I will go ahead and, uh, you know, I'm going to continue on with my gameplays. I'll record them, and I'll put them up here on Nalio Gaming for you all to see. I appreciate you watching. If you haven't already done so, please click that like button. Let me know in the comment section what you think. And subscribe to me here on Nalio Gaming. So as as we've seen so far, the game is huge. The map is gigantic. There's a ton to do. There's a ton to see. In my opinion, it's kind of like a, a Skyrim type game. Um, I do like that you can go third person, first person, whatever you want. Um, there's tons of conversations. And it gives you the option to choose what's going to happen um what path you want to take and 
it's that's really interesting and, and that could go a lot of different ways so it's obviously going to take some time to play through and that's a good thing but i'll go ahead and record them and post them here on Nalio gaming for you all to see so again subscribe to me here on Nalio gaming i appreciate you watching and i'll see you next time